Good morning, friends. This is Bobby Shanks with Shanks Realty Group, and this is another episode of Kitchen Talk. Okay, so you know what I'm holding here. This is a register that goes in uh, the floor, the walls of your home. And as you all know or have seen that these open and close like this. So what we're gonna talk about today is a question that I get asked as a realtor, oddly enough, pretty often. Um, everybody wants to control their heating bill because it just seems like in the winter time, especially when we get those first cold snaps, uh, we want to crank our heat way up so that we're nice and cozy. Now, a lot of you live in homes that you have spare bedrooms or office spaces or lofts or whatever, or maybe you just got a big giant house and you have empty rooms, so what do you do? You go into those rooms and you shut the vent thinking, oh, this is gonna help me save on my heating bill, whether it's gas or electric. Well, here's the truth. Because every house has a cold air return, you might be throwing your thermostat off and some houses are single versus dual zone or even have electronically controlled motherboards called a damper system. This is not the right way to do this. What you want to do instead is to equally on each floor, if you want to control uh, your heat, try to do it using the thermostat. But if you end up with one room that's warmer than another, for example, a bedroom on the west side of the house facing the sun, never close it all the way. Just control the airflow like this. So using partial open and close, uh, you know, this is probably too much. This is probably pointless, but you know, something that's like half or two thirds or something like that. So kind of a useful little tip uh, that I learned recently, and uh, I hope you uh, get value from it, and especially in this cold season. <music> 